What's up guys, my name is Javi and welcome to episode 6 of how to use Photoshop and today is going to be teaching you on how to use the displacement effect so as you can see right here I just have a black canvas with a flare on it and I'm going to show you basically how to use the displacement effect and how to use it in the best way or at least how I use it and I like to call it the best way so anyways uh, what you want to do but you want to have your layer selected on um, what you want to displace. Now, if you don't know what this, this, the displacement effect is, is it basically just completely destroys and it messes up and it makes things look like they're uh, just completely obliterated. And it, I think it's a cool effect. So, what you want to do is go to Filter, Distort, Displace. Now, depending on what you want to do with your image, with your image I meant to say uh, always you want to have stretch to fit and repeat edge pixels that's what you want to have selected and then depending on what you want to do horizontal is obviously uh, well it always depends on what you're you know you're doing so uh, I, I guess for this one we'll just do we'll just keep it a 10 over 10 keep it even hit OK now you're gonna have to have a PSD which you don't know if that which if you don't know what that is it's a Photoshop template file and I already have them saved and if this video gets 15 likes I'm gonna give this one I found uh, by myself uh, this is the one that rated designs found and uh, props to him but I'm not actually gonna use that one I'm actually gonna use the one that I found and yeah, if this video gets 15 likes, then I'll get this one away. I think it looks pretty cool. So, and you uh, you have to have uh, if you don't want to have mine, I'd recommend any really space image that you know something that looks similar to mine. If you want to go on Google Images and just find your own. But anyways, uh, yeah. So after that, you just hit open, and then it will obliterate, destroy, mess up your image as you can see it's not the same anymore as if I hit control Z no whoops there we go and then forward as you can see it basically just destroys the uh, your image so that's basically how you do the displacement effect that's at least how I do it remember select your image then follow the steps that I did before and if this video gets 15 likes, then I'll release the download link for the one that I just used. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like and maybe a comment down below. And if you're new, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.